Limba 2 introduces a host of new features, yet they follow the same principles that you already know from version 1. At the same time, we've refined those methods so that they have more consistency than ever and they're even easier to learn. Limba 2 can rig any type of layer into a limb using its new pre-comp limbs. They are a single layer even when you add multiple art layers into them, so you can easily duplicate and copy and paste them exactly like shape layer limbs. Limba now incorporates both rig and pose and path to bone in a unified limb creation workflow. It knows when you're using three circles or a three point path to indicate pivot points for any type of limb, including raster layers. You can add tangents to a path indicator and Limba will adopt that curvature into a path based limb. Freeke mode is a new way to animate rigged characters where the knee or elbow has its own controller that you can blend and match just like IK and FK. Freeke gives you full control over your rig, so actions like leading with the elbow and front walk cycles are much easier to animate. The limb library is now fully integrated, and you can preview, tag filter and download from over 100 customizable presets. You'll always be served the latest version of the constantly expanding library from our online repository straight to your comp. Add three puppet pins to a layer, click Limba's new button, and you've got a puppet limb ready to animate. Our expressions work with both the old and new puppet engines, and you can copy, paste, and duplicate puppet limbs just like any other. FK and joint controllers have been replaced with locators. Locators can track any point on a limb, and they're what you'll need to get hands and feet to auto-rotate. You can now add artwork into an existing limb with literally one click of a button. All your layers will be added to the lower section or the upper section if you hold the Alt key. Autoflop has become a standard feature in rigging tools and now Limba has its own way to automatically change bend direction. Limbs now scale automatically when you scale a master layer including the width of any strokes. If you duplicate an asymmetrical limb for the other side of a character, you can use a new flip art toggle. The new UI is responsive and reliable with crisp vector graphics. Every dialogue has a button that'll take you straight to the relevant page of the all new user guide. We'll be adding three bone limbs for animals, insects and fingers to version 2.1, which will be a free upgrade out within a year. I couldn't be more excited about Limba 2 because Mike and I have put everything we know about character animation and After Effects into this, and we would love you to use it to keep making amazing work. Thanks for watching. Thank you.